Hey, Pastor Steve Waldron here. This is one of like the basic Bible study tools. Now I know you can get it online, Olive Tree, Accordance, everything else in between, but you know, for just hard copy Bible reference, especially in the King James Version, this is it. This is Strong's Exhaustive Concordance. James Strong in the late 19th century found every word in the King James Bible and every place where it is mentioned. And you know, Strong's Concordance is a huge thing, and uh, it's called exhaustive. A lot of people make a lot of fun of that because it's so huge, it gets you exhausted reading it. And this is an edition put out by Hendrickson, and I'll give you a little hint here. On this particular one, it was $7.99. Now you'll see on the front it says regular $29.95, value price $19.97, which is a great price for a Strong's Concordance. But uh, I got this one for $7.99, and the reason is, one thing you'll want to do, if you don't mind these type things, which I don't, because I'm very limited income, extraordinary limited income, is you'll see this, the, the front cover has just a little indention. So they've got these on sale for $9.99, but then it'll say slightly damaged for $7.99. I get tons of my books on the slightly damaged thing. Um, eBay. I get thrift books, Better World books, Goodwill Industries. You know, why pay 30 bucks for a book when I can get it for $3.74 and free shipping off of, of eBay? And because uh, I don't have to have a perfect copy to get the information that I need out of here. So this is what a Strong's Concordance looks like. Now, it may appear kind of tough to use, it's not. And this is actually much smaller than like the Zondervan and the Nelson Strongs. And I'll show you why that it's actually much smaller. But it's, it's good readable print. They've got, you see the shadings, that's normally the words of Jesus are shaded in red. Well, let me show you why it's smaller. Is because a lot of very common words they put in the back like this instead of doing so it's basically the major words you have the strong's hebrew and greek in i'll probably do another video won't do it on this video on how to use a strong's concordance i'm not sure if i've ever done a video on that because i did another video a couple years ago on the strongest strongs that's the one put out by zondervan it's got a lot of neat things in it the one i personally use is the nelson and it's falling apart and so i kind of got this to replace the nelson but i'm thinking i may have to pray and believe the lord to get the money to <laughs> actually buy the Nelson one because the, I like the Nelson one just a little bit better than this. But basically what you do, if it's an Old Testament verse, you go to the Hebrew and the Aramaic section in the back with the numbering system, and it'll say H in front of it. And if it's uh, Greek, you go to the Greek section in the back and you just match up the numbers and it tells you the words. Now I know you can go for free. I do this. Go to blueletterbible.com and uh, that's, that's my go-to. I know a lot of people love Bible Hub. Uh, to me, blue letters just more intuitive, easier to use. That's just what it is. But it's so fascinating too that uh, Paleo Hebrew, Greek, and English are all cognate or sister languages. So, just really recommend this. It has every major word in the Bible. We'll look up like window and windows and winds. And you can see right down here, that's every place where those words are used. And where to find it. And one of the fascinating things you'll find that like wind, you know, it may not be the same Hebrew or Greek word in every instance. And so there may be nuances of meaning there, but uh, just a fantastic study tool. Um, many, many people have said if they were stranded on a desert island and could only have three things, if they had their 
the King James Bible, their Strong's Exhaustive Concordance, and a new Unger's Bible Dictionary, they could get along just fine. But God, in His wisdom and mercy, has poured out His Spirit upon everybody. Not everybody's received it, but in Him we live, move, and have our being. Paul said to a bunch of pagans, the Holy Ghost is, is everywhere. And uh, then you've got nature you look at, and then all these study tools. There's no excuse not to live for Jesus Christ. So, talk with you later. Great deal. $7.99 for this monster hardback book. Oh, and before we do, let's see this thing. Look at how big this thing is. It's about 11 inches. And I'm going to guess it weighs like five or six pounds. You know what? I may look in the back too for something here. I was going to end this video, and most of you probably already signed off. So it's uh, eight and a half inches. And let's see how thick this guy is. It's, oh, it's only two and a half inches thick. But it's huge. It's, it's really big. Now, Hendrickson's been using 1873 Scribner's a lot, which is not exactly like a 1769 or a 1900 Cambridge. So I'm wondering if they do that in this. I just want to see something real quick. I just read something on the back. Yeah, okay. It's got the nice black and white maps in it. So that's kind of cool. I like the Nelson edition. It's got all kinds of stuff. One other thing I will mention as well is you might not think this tab would be of any use, this tabination, but it is. Like finding, you know, A, B, C, and all this. It's really good. So I'd recommend this. God bless. Talk with you later in Jesus' name.